So everyone, we'd like to welcome back our patient for today, Ms. Apples. How are you doing? Good, how are you? Good, good, thanks. Are you staying safe and indoors? Mm -hmm. Very good. Thanks so much for uh, doing this for us again. We're almost there. Um, so today we're just going to do a quick musculoskeletal assessment. Right? So we're going to um, test your range of motion and, and your strength um, throughout your upper and lower body. Okay? Okay, dokie. Great. So, um, but before we do, any, I'm going to just have to ask you a few questions. Um, any pain anywhere in your body? Nope. Great. Um, any problems moving your joints or general range of motion? No. Okay, good. Any issues with your ADLs? Maybe like brushing your teeth, taking a shower. Um, ADLs are your activities of daily living. Um, or maybe just moving around the house. Do you have any problems with those? Not, not that I know. Okay, great. So um, now we're just going to do some activities. You can go ahead and just imitate me. And then if at any point you have any pain, just let me know. Okay, no, okay. Yeah. So um, let's start with your neck. So I want you to move your neck forward and then backwards. Nice. Now to the left. Good. And to the side, the other side. Nice. Okay. Now I want you to try to touch your um, left ear to your left shoulder. Good. Now the other side. Yeah, without raising your shoulders. <laughs> okay, good. So um, any discomfort while you're doing that? No. Good. So as we can see, we have full range of motion in your neck uh, without limitations, and you said there's no pain, right? So no tenderness. Good. So now we're just going to um, test your shoulder strength. So I'm just going to place my hands on your shoulders and just do a quick shoulder shrug for me. Good. So very good um, shoulder strength. That's a five out of five um, bilaterally. So now we're going to test your um, shoulder movement. Okay. All right. So I want you to go ahead and do the hello. Hello. And down, okay? And then we're gonna do the wave, and then like you're gonna be diving. Good, so no pain, no tenderness? No. Nice, okay. So um, now we are going to um, test your elbows, okay? So let's start in this position, and then flex for me, and then down. Okay, good, so no pain, no tenderness, okay. very good. So we have full range of motion of your shoulders and your elbows so far. Um, and then we've already tested your shoulders, so you're good on the strength part of that. Now we'll do a strength test on your elbows, okay? Sure. So I want you to go ahead and put yourself in a position like you're gonna go boxing. Very good. So I'm gonna just um, apply some resistance here and then just pull uh, backwards. There you go, wow, that's strong. And then <laughs> push forward, good, good. So you have very good um, elbow strength bilaterally, that's a five. Um, over five. Now I want you to pretend like you're gonna ride a motorcycle, just like that, like vroom, vroom. Okay, good. So I'm gonna just um, hold your your uh, fist here, and I want you to try to lower your um, hand your your hand by moving your wrist. Good. So that's a nice strength there. To the other side. Very good. So again, you're strong bilaterally in your wrists, right? Now let's test the range of motion. So we're gonna do the close, open, close, open. Did you see that when you're a baby? Maybe. Maybe, <laughs> baby, maybe. <laughs> okay, now we'll do the doggy paws. Nice, good. So it's smooth, right? The movement is smooth, there's no pain? Nope. Okay, very good. Now we'll do the pigeon head. Very good. So very nice full range of motion in both of your wrists. Um, again, there's no tenderness, so we're good to go there. Now we'll do a um, hand grip test, okay? So we're gonna test how strong your, your grip is. Just gonna, are you right-handed, left-handed? I am right-handed. Okay, great. So I want you to just grab uh, each hand with your, each set of fingers with your hand, right? And just go ahead and squeeze. Ow, you're very strong. Good job, thank you, Miss Apples. So um, hand grip strength is strong bilaterally, so we're good to go there. So now that we're done with the upper body, we're going to practice with your lower body, okay? Okay. Okay. So I want you to go ahead and just bend forward, just spread your legs for your balance, and down. Very good. So no strength, no pain or discomfort? No. Okay, good. Um, now if you could just please take a seat here. Um, I'll be right back one second, please. Okay. So now what we want to do is just test um, your leg strength. Mm -hmm. So what we're going to be looking for here is we're going to be testing your, your quads 
and your hamstrings, okay? So I'm just gonna go ahead and apply my hands to this area of your legs. Just go ahead and push forward. Whoa, nice, very good strength. And then pull towards you, very good. So in terms of your um, knee strength, we're looking good. Uh, both sides are strong bilaterally, okay? Now we're gonna move down to your, um, to your ankle area. Thank you, Miss Apples, I forgot. I had a senior moment there. <laughs> So um, let's test for range of motion in your ankle area, okay? So I want you to just go ahead and point your toes upwards. Very good plantar flexion, and then point them down, downwards. Very good dorsiflexion and side to side. Nice, very good. So um, full range of motion bilaterally. Um, no pain, no discomfort? Nope. Okay, great, so we're also non-tender. Now I'm just gonna go ahead and test your ankle strength. So go ahead and point your toes up for me. Wow, okay, very good. And then point them down. Nice, so ankle strength is also looking good. So if we could just please stand up real quick again, and maybe to this area here. Okay, so. Whoa. Okay, maybe let's switch sides here. Very good, just right there. Okay. Now we're gonna test um, range of motion of your spine. So just put your hands to your hips <laughs> and then just turn this way and then other side. Good, okay, now tilt to the left side. There you go, that's your right. <laughs> oh, then I got it wrong. Okay, now to the other side. Very good, now tilt backwards and now tilt forward as if you're gonna touch your toes. Very good. So I'm just going to go ahead and lift your shirt, okay? Okay. So as we can see here, anatomically speaking, the scapulars are right here, and then the spine is nice and straight, so there's no sign of curvature, so that's good. Um, so spine is straight, no signs of curvature, and full range of motion of the spine.